One of the actresses I've never really been a fan of is Kiki Palmer. This has always been something about her I never rocked with. I never said anything against her, but I've never been like, yeah, Kiki Palmer, I want her for this role. I want to see her in this. I find her old attractive. She's just been there. But yet somehow she has garnered the name of America's Sweetheart, even though she has not shown any, any, any resemblance of an American Sweetheart, at least that's in my opinion. We're now coming into an age where more and more men are being shown that they have been assaulted or essayed and just haven't spoke about it by men and women and physically assaulted by men and women. For in case, Kiki Palmer and her uh, baby daddy, Darius Jackson. Now, Darius Jackson at the time of the court still has a restraining order against him because of the steals and the accusation of Kiki Palmer. Again, there are the steals and not the full video clip. I still question those clips on uh, those steals because if it was really what it was, we would have saw the full motion pictures by now. Anyways, Darius Jackson came out with receipts and did a countersuit, which I'm glad he did, saying that Kiki is abusive. And here's a screenshot of some of the uh, text messages that was put out there that Kiki responded to him, pretty much admitting to being the aggressor and a bad person and for hitting him and all this other kind of stuff. But yet this part has not made the news nowhere near as much as when Kiki filed that suit. And it's, it's reminding me of this whole entire Diddy situation. People for years have sat here and tried to tell people about Diddy because he was at a higher social status that he was protected by the powers by being. The media didn't really report on it. It all stayed kind of hush hush along the bloggers who actually reported on it. Same thing with Kiki Palmer. There's a counter suit out there. You barely hear anything about it. But yet, if you look for it, you'll find it. You'll see the evidence that he's presenting to get it dismissed and trying to accuse her. But again, when she came out with his steals, not video, the steals, which means she reviewed it, picked out the worst parts that made him look bad and presented as evidence so everybody gets sympathy for her. Nothing. And if you read how some of those test messages read, it reminds me eerily of how her mama talked to Darius, which makes me think that really Kiki did say this stuff. Because you learn how to talk to people from your parents. So tell me, what do you guys think? Do you think Kiki is really guilty? I, I really do think she is guilty. And leave a comment if you do. Because here's the thing. I really do think Kiki is uh, putting up a front. And she's just uh, playing the woman role. Even though she's a feminist and believes in equal rights and dates women, men, interracial, irracially, whatever else. She's still playing on that woman role to where she will get sympathy and not take accountability. And she'll do some fake accountability to keep Darius in her life. Which I'm assuming he got tired of, especially after his reputation has been ruined by her lawsuit. I, I, I kind of want to know the full story of that. But yet Darius I already said too much about it. It seems like he's just more focused on his kid. Which I wish Kiki would do. Because realistically speaking, what kind of mother could she really be? Excuse me, what kind of mother could she really be? If she's always working, the kid's gonna stay with somebody. And truth, the way Kiki Palmer's mama talked, I wouldn't want my child with her mama either. Anyways, like, comment, subscribe. You guys tell me what you think. I hope you guys have a great day. Thank you for watching.